We've seen an all-girls island, we're the only boy, in a previous episode, but what about an all-girls jail, we're the only guy that got sent to the jail. Guys, welcome back to my second channel where we react to weird stories, and today, we're reacting to the only boy in a girl's prison. Also, I do want to point out, guys, this is, a, this is like a different channel, like I normally don't look at a channel like this, but today I thought, yeah, let's try a different, unique channel and have a new take on it, and so we're gonna see, is this good or is this like total, total bull crap? <laughs> I don't know. Let's find out. Hi. I'm Marcus, I'm 23, and I've always been Hi, Marcus. surrounded How are by you? girls. In drama club at school, at okay. home, where I have okay. three older sisters, and at my job. I will wait until the motorcycle stops revving. Thank you. After all, I'm a security guard in the woman's all state right. prison, Let's and enjoy. every day I am surrounded by several hundred women with different stories. Wow. I ended up falling in love with one of them. I'm going to tell you about what came of it and how we happened to meet. My boy fell in love with a prisoner? What is this? This is not a prison, dude. You got a joker looking woman in the back of you. Like, a, what, what is this? A guitar, why, how, how do you got a guitar person on the other side? You got a girl like crying and something taping her mouth open or being cut. I don't know, but this is very disturbing. I will never forget how I first found myself alone with these women in baggy jumpsuits. <laughs> okay. It wow. Was my first Attractive. Day on the job. My type of lady. My partner, who had worked there for more than 10 years, had been making scathing jabs about my appearance all morning, calling Why? me Justin Bieber. Does Justin Bieber have a butt as a mouth? Because we got a butt, we got a butt mouth here, folks. Put put butt turds, you know, gonna poop out of your mouth with that. Yeah. He kept doing it so that I wouldn't even think about making eyes at anyone. Because any relationship with prisoners was Bad. forbidden. But no I'm kidding. <laughs> I already knew that. Before dinner, I was sent to recount all the prisoners in Block A. It was a large room divided by partitions into many tiny rooms without doors. What a disgusting design for a prison. Like you could have at least painted the walls, man. All the prisoners lined oh. up in front of their beds and were checking out the newbie. Wow. Most of all that day, I remembered two of them. One that scared me to death and one oh, that I dang, unexpectedly that is liked. Ooh. The first put a hand on my shoulder and went uh -oh. slyly with her one good eye. They called her old woman because she had been there the longest. Dang, can you imagine the writers? Yo, hey, what do you think we should name this this old woman? Did you try old woman? Oh my gosh, that's brilliant. Yes, old woman. Great. I told her to get back immediately, but I said it so timidly that internally I scolded myself for sure. Dang, weakness. she's too happy to be here in jail. But by the end of the rounds, I had completely forgotten about it because okay. in the last cell, I is she actually going to be attractive? Loris. Did you I say read Alors? her name on the badge. Loris. If I had met her in ordinary life, uh -huh, I would okay, have Loris. definitely asked her out on a date. Wow, what a name. The next day, I saw her in the hallway. She smiled at me, and I involuntarily smiled back. Oh. Then I became angry with myself. Loris, guys, prediction. I always do make a prediction in these videos, all right? Stay with me here. Loris is going to make him fall in love with her so that she can use him to escape from prison. Then she's going to kill him and eat him. For the whole next month, I tried to not even look at her and even avoided her. But Loris was always there, or she, she was would looking come for you, bro. With some She's just trying to escape. Stupid question. Gradually, it became a habit. We would smile at each other when no what? one was looking. Did he just scoop off food with his pipe? I'm confused with that. I don't know what we just saw. When no one was listening, during room inspections, I secretly began leaving little surprises for her: oh, chewing gum under the pillow no. and a bar of chocolate under the blanket. Bro, you're about to get in some Sometimes trouble. Sometimes we managed to meet in the courtyard behind the church and talk privately for about five wow. minutes. Why Soon is she in I jail? I caught myself thinking that I was only coming back to work for these encounters. Did we never find out why she got arrested? Oh, man. I really wanted to make her comfortable. Loris told me that she often spent time in the library in the mornings wow. and that there was almost never anyone else around. Dang, I'll go to prison if I get my own library to be alone in and read every day. Like, I mean, I won't, but like, I will. You know what I mean? Like, I won't do it, but like, I will do it. You know? One morning on my way to work, I stopped for the best donuts in the city and delicious coffee. Oh, I knew that man. she had been longing for those. He got her some. This Big is Max adorable. Pizza. Wow. Loris told me later that it was the best breakfast she had had in a year. Oh, man. This is giving me some kind of Romeo and Juliet vibes, you know? You got that prison guard and you got that redhead Wendy's looking girl. Get her some Wendy's. I bet she'll appreciate that. One day, she asked me to send her a postcard. 
Aww. On my day off, I chose the cutest one I could find and wrote that I couldn't wait Dude, for the day when you. I could Dude, she's give playing you. She's playing you. Can't person. you see it in her eyes? She doesn't like you. I signed the card with my initials in reverse order and sent it without a return address. Wow. The most difficult thing for me was not exposing our correspondence. Yeah, that's probably really difficult to hide a freaking relationship with a prisoner. But I also feel like Romeo and Juliet, you got that going for you. It's like a good thing too. But one day... I almost ruined everything. Okay. My partner, Flint, as usual, had begun poking fun at the prisoners. He mentioned Loris. I could barely restrain oh, no. <laughs> myself from making him take his words oh my back. Goodness. Come on, it's dude. Not easy get her. for me to admit it, but sometimes I even thought about arranging for her to escape so that she no longer had to live in this dump. Almost like that's her people. plan the whole time. I'm Although just saying, we haven't even heard her speak yet. We don't know what she's thinking. We don't know what's going through her mind. We know that this dude is simping. He's a simp. I feel I feel weird saying that word. Does anyone else like feel dirty when they say the word simp? Like it's just uncomfortable. Like that's it's just whew, does not come off the tongue, right? Made any mistakes? One day, the worst happened. No, she died. That day, we received an order to completely search every room. Ooh. All of the women at the time were in the yard. I searched Loris's bed. In a box under the bed, I found my postcard and couldn't help but smile. Oh. But there were other cards too. Other? It's other jail More than 20, and all without a return address. I began comparing the initials oh, of the no. names on those that were signed. Dude, with you the creep. names of other wardens. I found more than 12 matches. Wow. I wow. Even bring myself I called it. I mean, you guys don't need to be a genius to call it, but still. Get wrecked, nerd. Two weeks later. Now I'm looking for a job that I like and what? where I work with men. Wait, I just what? want to forget about Loris. Thank you for listening to my what? story. What? <laughs> That's it. What? What? Why do these videos do that? Why do you make a 10 minute video when it's, you just do it for the ad money. I get it. But like, you, you're teasing me. We don't even know what the second half of this video is. Now we're going in undercover black screen. No idea what we're about to get into. This could be some weird uwu looking stuff. We don't even know. I'm shocked. Let's just continue then and see what we get here. Could be even more better stuff. Bonus story. Wow, what could this be about? Hi, I'm Michael. I'm 27. Look, he's using booble. All right, I'm excited. And soon my dating life will ruin me. After okay. all, for every date with a girl, I pay her at least a thousand dollars. Imagine a little kid watching this and he's like, Mom, we go to Booble. She's like, What did you say, Jimmy? Go to Booble, mommy. And I just can't. It's weird. That's weird. That's weird. But that's how like, I ended up. Kids in watch this stuff, right? Like, I feel like kids do. Situation. I feel like adults don't watch this. It's weird. I work for my father's law firm, and in the future, the family business should be mine. Working 50 hours a week is not at all what I wanted, but yeah. otherwise, my old man will leave me with nothing. Oh, okay. Living up to his expectations my whole life, I've never done what I love. Oh, no. He always decided where I would go to school, what kind of sport to do, and with whom to be friends. Let me guess, this one's titled, or was titled before it failed to be the main story, My Dad Controls My Life or something like that, right? Saturday but evening, creepier. I be myself. But now, because of one such Saturday, I risk losing everything for which I have strived for so many years. What happened? That Saturday, as usual, I was at the club, and, yeah, as usual, yeah. left there with a girl. I think you're still in the, uh, it seemed in like the you morning, were still in the club, as usual. I had already learned how to end these flings long ago. Dang, this dude's confident. Hope for a next time. <laughs> wow, Tuesday, okay. I received email from her to my work mail. Uh oh. She sent a revealing photo and a caption that read, "Let's do it again. This is Madeline." Ooh. Where did you get my email address? I asked. She stole a business card. She replied card. and said that I could not even imagine what else she had on me. She had arranged for us to meet at 8 o'clock in the most famous restaurant in the city. Oh, snap. It took considerable effort for me to reserve a table that same evening. Wow. Madeline's makeup, clothes, hairstyle, I never would have met up with her again. But in this case, it <laughs> is not my decision. Since I it's not, He like says it while he's sitting there eating dinner with her. He's like, guys, it, I don't, I don't want to be here. I don't want to, I don't, I don't want to be here. I hate this girl. I wasn't planning to linger. I told her that I would only have a cup of coffee. She said she wanted a glass of white wine, a okay. salad, okay. and spaghetti. Thousand dollars. I could pay with oh. a check, and not, <laughs> I did not see necessarily that coming. This is a good story. I was about to laugh, but yeah. changed my mind given her arrogant and confident look. Look who's talking, buddy! Look who's talking about being arrogant. My boys over here. Do you hear what you said like five minutes ago? 
Without letting me answer, she said that she had a video of our entire Saturday night, and the most wow. interesting and exciting fragments would certainly arrive by mail to both my father and all my employees if I... That's why I live with a no technology in my house allowed rule. When I walk in, I become Amish. Then I leave for the day, I go to my other apartment, and that's my technology in her place. Requirements that's that why. Day. I told her that I first had to see this video in order to decide whether it was worth even half the amount she was asking. Oh, man. $1,000. This is the price for the opportunity to see it first. Oh, and wow. Perhaps you'll be the only one, was her answer. That evening, I just go to the police, man. I don't, I wouldn't mess around. I'd be like, all right, the restaurant, <laughs> see ya. She got everything she ordered, including the check which I wrote. In the yo, yo, guys, rewind that. Write down his accounting numbers. You can steal his, his info right there. Get your own checks. The file showed up in my email. Yes, it was definitely worth the money. Uh, then another message. She had made another appointment at the restaurant. I was oh no. seething with rage because I already paid her. What did she want from me now? She's gonna ask you again, dude. She That's how asked it works. Me for another one thousand dollars. She's gonna keep doing it until you stop paying. I restrain myself from making a scene. With that attitude, you didn't have to come at all, Madeline said. Wow. And send me the money right away. The total value of this video is a million dollars. Either <laughs> pay it all up front or get ready for many more meetings to come. If wow. you don't do it, I will send this file to your father, colleagues, friends. I will post it on every site there is. That's, I mean, usually that's like the crazy hot scale. This would be, you would expect a super hot girl to be saying this, but she's not in this drawing. So she's broken the crazy hot scale. So the story's fake based on that. After that, what now? <laughs> you won't just lose your father's business. You'll never be able to work in any law firm again. Well, except oh, maybe as a janitor. Two months have passed since that second meeting. And in that time, there have been eight more. It's have not you paid? hard to calculate how much it cost me. You're probably wondering what is on that video and how am yeah, I stuck in all this? But no. I reached out to my sources and found out that Madeline's brother had been practicing with his father not so long ago. To do Obviously, what? What after that, that one of them came up with the idea to set me up and get some easy money. Wow. Meeting in the club, the hotel room, at the time, wow. it seemed funny to me. But now this, this joke will either ruin me or destroy my career and deprive me of my inheritance. It's, it's it's spent nine thousand dollars on this so far. Like, have you not thought like, hmm, the police could help with blackmail? It's, it's I don't illegal. know how to stop all this. What would you do in my place if you were blackmailed by a girl who threatened to show everyone a video that would simply destroy you? It's literally illegal, dude. It's literally breaking the law. That's it. That's how it ends. Wow, look how much filler there's in here. This is. 40 seconds of filler because they couldn't get 10 minutes for that second ad to put in here for the extra 50 cents on your stupid story because it doesn't even make sense. You go to the police, all right? No one is going to pay $9,000 for that. No one. And you guys suck for a minute of bullcrap wasted space to sketch ad money, all right? Don't you do that to me again, all right? My videos are content. 10 minutes of content. And you say, wow, lover fella, good. Thank you for 10 minutes of content. You say, wow, lover fella, I can't wait to click that subscribe button because I watched this whole video right now and you're speaking right to me and I feel it. I feel that you're speaking to me. I'm gonna click that subscribe button, young boy, young man. I'm gonna do it. You do it right now. I'm gonna click that screen. I'll see you guys later, please.